Hey guys, this is the Polynesian. If y'all have never stayed here, you need to. Super, super tropical here. Really dark at night too, really nice atmosphere. They have a beach, it's right next to Magic Kingdom. You can see the castle, the fireworks. You got the monorail right here. Really awesome spot. The pool is okay. It's a volcano pool. It's just okay. Really, really great spot though. Pool's a little tight. The jacuzzi in the main pool's a little tight. The jacuzzi in the quiet pool is much better. Actually, I think the quiet pool is much better as well. Here's the bungalows at the Polynesian. Got the transportation and ticket center off there to the right side. The ferry boat to the Magic Kingdom is behind those bungalows over there. Coming up here is a really nice spot to watch the fireworks. It's quite a big hill that you walk up. I'll take you guys up there real quick. Kind of strange seeing a big hill like that, but it's a good view. Really cool Hawaiian music. Got the Grand Floridian out there, the wedding pavilion, the new Polynesian tower going up. They're making quick progress on that. I don't know how I feel about that yet. I don't like views changing and sight lines changing and kind of, I don't know, it's a little, it's a little annoying. Let me know what you guys think about that. But up here is a really cool spot. If y'all could see the castle off in the distance. What do you guys think about that tower? I mean, when it's done, I'm sure it'll look really nice and it'll be landscaped really well, but I just think they need to slow it up a little bit. If anybody knows why they got rid of the little water mice, the little boats you can rent with your kids, let me know. I don't know why they got rid of those, and those were such a unique feature of Walt Disney World. Used to see all the kids with their fathers and mothers out there driving their little boats on the lake with their big smiles and all these marinas around here had all the boats sitting up in them. It was really unique. And now it's just like everything else. And you have these marinas sitting empty. It's crazy. It's the wedding pavilion out there, guys. And if you guys didn't know, you can get married here at Walt Disney World. A little fun fact, Tara and I got married here at Walt Disney World. <laughs> and here is the main pool, volcano pool. Look how packed it is. Oh my goodness. Wow. You could see the hot tub I was talking about right up there. It's packed with kids. <laughs> It's not very big to begin with. We got a little bar. Here's the dock where you can catch your boat to Magic Kingdom. Or to the Grand Floridian. You used to be able to walk it, but now that they're building that tower, that walkway is shut down. That used to be an awesome walk. I hope they open up a walk something similar when it's done. And here is one of those docks I'm talking about. 
They used to have water mice all up in this channel right here. And used to be able to rent them. Good afternoon, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good, thanks. Yeah, they used to have a whole bunch right here. You just drive up in here, and then you drive out over there. I don't know why they got rid of them. They had them for so many years, as long as I can remember. I remember getting them when I was a kid with my father. And now, nothing. It's crazy. There's a little kid park they have at the, the pool. Right here is a good spot to watch the fireworks as well. You can see the castle out there, off in the distance. So it's right next to the pool here. And then up here to the left, you go up some steps and you go into the main lobby. Here's the main lobby, the Polynesian. Up top there, you have Kona. That's a great little restaurant. And then you got check-in right over there. You got the main pool straight out that way. You got Dole Whip right out there to the left. Little gift shop. Of course, I already had to eat some. Tastes like Lucky Charms. You don't like marshmallow. That's why I said one. That's all this is. If it comes out. Looks like it's his birthday. 